All right, joining me on set, local ER pediatrician with Asha Lafayette, General Dr. Scott Hamilton. Good morning. Good morning, Danielle. So we are here to talk about a very important topic. February is, of course, Black History Month right. and Heart Health Month. And yes. you're here to talk about how the two go together. We're talking both, yeah. So my wife for Christmas gave me this book, American Sirens, mm -hmm. um, which is about the first paramedic um, uh, service in the whole country in the 1960s. It was an all-black paramedic service founded partially by the guy who invented CPR, Dr. Wow. Safer. Invented CPR, he moves to Pittsburgh um, and uh, ends up being part of this new service um, to bring advanced medical care to the streets of Pittsburgh. Um, and um, um, the, the, the paramedics overcome adversity and prejudice and emergencies, right, medical yeah. emergencies, um, to become a, the, a national model for how you um, take care of people in the streets with advanced medical care. So connecting it to all to uh, Black History Month, the first paramedics were all it was black. all black service mm -hmm. because the city of Pittsburgh, you know, they were okay with their crappy, um, you know, police throwing people into paddy wagons mm -hmm. and driving them to the hospital. But they said, oh, okay, you can do it over in this, in the inner city part of Pittsburgh. And <laughs> surprise, surprise, though some of the most impoverished people in Pittsburgh were getting the best emergency medical care. Right, right. So talking about CPR today, a very important thing for everyone. Yes, they were bringing CPR and Dr. Safar, when he invented CPR, intended it for everyone to be able to do. In fact, in their original studies, again, crazy stories from that book, where he had Boy Scouts as young as 10 years old in the studies reviving paralyzed, anesthetized study volunteers wow. um, to show that even 10-year-old kids could revive people and save people's lives with CPR. So to honor the heroes of um, um, uh, Freedom Hill Ambulance, Freedom House Ambulance, the name of the company, Learn CPR. And we have a graphic with many places in Lafayette we can go to learn CPR. Um, and it may save a life. I've seen it save scores of kids over my career. Scores of adults are saved as long as you know it. Be the Beat is the American Heart Association um, Heart Month um, website to learn about CPR. Remember Damer Hamlin last month, um, safety for oh, the yeah. Uh, yeah, CPR. safety for the oh, yeah. bills, uh, collapsed on the field, revived and saved by CPR. Now has his website. Uh, take the Dalen. Uh, D Damar Hamlin's number three for heart CPR challenge to learn CPR. Yeah. Locally, CPR2Go.com and SASTrainers.com um, are two places you can go to learn CPR. And of course, of course, my Oshner. home, Oshner Lafayette General. Um, lots of courses on infant CPR for prospective parents. Um, and, and also, you can uh, take regular CPR courses there. Go to the website and sign up for a course. Learn CPR. So. You can save a life. Yeah, thank you so much, Dr. Scott Hamilton. Of course, every time you come, you give us give us great information oh, that we thanks. need. Uh, again, thanks for joining me on set. All this information, of course, will be on our KOFY YouTube and Facebook page. We'll and get be the right book; back. it's great. Reading. Yeah, get the book. We'll be right back.